Hello guys, it's Jaguar here. Today I'm bringing you an audio commentary on, I believe this map is called Vertigo. It's from the new Uprising DLC that was released today at 3 a.m. for me and midnight Pacific Standard Time. I'm not sure about anywhere else. You guys can figure that out for yourself, but. Right now, it's out everywhere, so there shouldn't be that issue. I really like this map pack so far. Vertigo, it was supposed to be sort of like High Rise, but I will say this. It is nothing like High Rise from Modern Warfare 2. Absolutely nothing like it. I was going into it thinking, it's sort of going to be a reskin and... Maybe a bit of a change, but have the same flow style. It, like, I was just like, seriously, why did you say it was sort of like high rise when it really, really is not like high rise? It is horrible. In if you were comparing it to high rise, but overall the map is good. It took me a bit to get oriented on the map that was the only thing but you'd expect that with every new map and same as the other maps it took me a little while to get oriented with them it sat, well sort of pissed me off in a sense but I was fine with it in another sense because of the fact that I really didn't have to do too too much which was fine with me I went on a nice streak. I went 12 and 1 at the beginning of this game. And then. Well. I didn't do. Great for the rest. I ended up finishing 25 and 7. I was running some so so streaks. They were just something I was testing out for free for all. And I had forgotten to change them. And I didn't really realize. Until about after 10 to 15 matches. And then I kind of. Realized that I had screwed it up and I should change my kill streaks. So I decided, okay, I'll change them and see what I can get next. So I did, did well. Oh, and one thing, you saw me just look down there. I was thinking, you know how you can jump up, it showed? I was thinking, maybe could I jump down? And I tried it back in a private match. And no, you can't. It's stupid, but makes sense. Otherwise, it would be a bit overpowered. Or a bit of uh, too much of a power spot, I guess. Not really sure. But as I was saying, like, the map is great. I really don't know what else to say. And the map is great, and it wasn't what we were promised. Or, I guess you wouldn't say promised per se, but what we were expecting. Like, it has, I like the flow of it, how you move. But the one thing is, I will recommend, is run it stream conditioning on a class for this map. Just because, I find, in order to build your streaks, you can't really go in the middle. Unless you just have amazing gun skill, you can just turn on people. You're putting in three, four bullets into a guy right on never missing around and you're just like popping c4s capture kills like nuts that's really the only way you're going to build your kill streaks going on the inside like i like to go in navigate my way about a quarter of the way through and then duck out go around flank in so that prevents me a bit of running but it still leaves a lot of running for me to do and that's not usually a good thing. I don't personally like it. I don't agree with it that it should be that way. But it just is that way. So we have to deal with it. So run extreme conditioning. Or at the bare minimal run lightweight. But I find extreme conditioning to be a better choice. Let me know what your guys thoughts are on vertigo and in if you enjoy please leave a like comment favorite and if you're new to my channel remember to subscribe thanks guys i'm out
Peace.